Hey guys, what's up? It's Patrick of Coaster Fanatics, and today I'm bringing you a pivot head POV of the Cedar Creek Mine Ride, the Aerodynamics Mine Train Coaster at Cedar Point. This coaster has a max height of 55 feet with a drop of 48 feet and a top speed of 42 miles per hour. The Cedar Creek Mine Ride opened in 1969 as the centerpiece of the new Frontier Town section of Cedar Point, making it the second oldest coaster at the park with Blue Streak being the oldest. So you guys, this coaster is just okay in my opinion. There are better aero mine train coasters out there. For example, Adventure Express at Kings Island. The Cedar Creek Mine Ride is one of the rougher mine trains I've been on. The turns really jerk you out of your seat, causing leg pain from the lap bar, as well as back and neck pain, potentially. I do like that some of this coaster is built on water, and the helix at the end is pretty fun. If you're an adult, I'd say skip this coaster. However, I know kids really do enjoy this coaster, so for them, I say enjoy the ride. I do believe that Cedar Point will tear down this coaster within the next five years. They are building a hybrid with the Mean Streak, and they already have a racing hybrid in Gemini, so they really don't need the Cedar Creek Mine Ride anymore. They are in need of a real wooden coaster, so I believe they will tear this coaster down and build a new GCI in its place as well as where Shoot the Rapids used to be. So ride this coaster while you can, because I think it's getting the axe soon, but I could be wrong. Okay you guys, hold on tight and enjoy your ride on the Cedar Creek Mine Ride. Welcome back riders, I hope you enjoyed the ride. If you did, please smash that like button. Do leave your thoughts in the comment section, and if you're new around here, please subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. 
Thanks for watching, you guys. Have a good one. I'll catch you on the next video very, very soon.